Mm-hmm. So today we're gonna to do a real quick and easy stir fry recipe. And if you couldn't tell from the nice little apron that I'm wearing today and the branding that I have in front here with these lovely packages, this episode is sponsored by Ice House. Now I tried these products before doing this video, um, just to give it a try and see how it works for myself before endorsing it. And I had to tell you, it's real convenient in terms of being able to whip up a quick dinner in two twos in different ways. You don't have to do just the stir fry, but I mean, today I do not stir fry. But let me tell you, these frozen vegetables, real convenient. So without further ado, I'm gonna jump into it. And I'm gonna show you how we're gonna use this. All right, so let me show you what's inside of each of these packages. We have the body here. And again, this is very ideal for you know, your moms or your working professionals on the go. It's something that you can just pull out of your freezer, throw into a pot, and make some quick meals one time with no fuss. All right, so we have two packs of frozen body inside of this bag here. And I mean, this is more than enough to feed, you know, your average size family. Um, today, I'll just be using like half a pack to make the stir fry rice noodles. I mean, I'm making two portions, one for me, one for Thomas behind the camera. So yeah, like half of this, I think would be good for two serving sizes. Um, four, four serving sizes would be like a full pack. And then well, the two could feed up to like eight people, eight to 10 people, I think, conservatively. So yeah, um, just using half of that and we're good to go with the body, and I'm gonna show you what's inside of the carrots, All right? So the carrots are assorted carrots, and I'll show you what's inside of this pack. So inside of this pack here, we have assorted carrots, and they have some like chopped carrots here, like kind of like grated. We have julienne, and we have carrots cut into like discs. You can tell from the assorted carrots here that each different type is, you know, ideal for different types of meals. So like this here, the discs would be perfect for like a soup or if you're doing like a chunky veg, the julienne, which I'll be using today, perfect for stir fry. So we'll be using this for the stir fry. And then we have some shredded carrots here and this will be good for stir fry as well but if you're going for something else smaller or finer maybe like in a fry rice or that kind of scene this will be definitely good for that or if you like to add um carrots to uh festive rice and that kind of scene too or like carrots in a macaroni pie i man like to pull carrots in my macaroni pie i think this would be ideal for that as well but today i'll just be using the julienne and again i'll be using half of this um half for two servings should be good. So let me jump into it and let me start this recipe. It's gonna be quick, it's gonna be easy. Let me do this. So I really wanna show you how quick this thing going. So we're gonna do this, everything happening one time, right? So I'm gonna water at a boil here. Not a rolling boil, but a gentle simmer. So I'm gonna put my rice noodles in. I'm gonna leave that to boil away. And now, I'm gonna prep my aromatics. Here we don't have to cut up, you know, no body and no carrots, but you know, onion and the garlic and thing is essential. So it's just that we had to cut up. And yes, I did say that the convenience of this is ideal for, you know, um, parents on the go who might be, you know, looking for easy ways to prepare meals for the family. Also for, you know, single young professionals who might not have, you know, that time to, you know, I don't want to say slave, it's not slaving, but you know, or, you know, young professionals who do have the time to really um, spend a set of time in the kitchen. So it's ideal for those types of people, but it's also real good for caterers as well. If you're into catering um, and you're looking for a good alternative, you know, in terms of cutting down on your prep time, then these frozen vegetables, 
And um, I also have other frozen products as well that I might be featuring in the future. Featuring in the future, that is a tongue twister. I'll be featuring in the future, so you can look out for that. Um, but yeah, it's really a good alternative for caterers as well. And Ice House is actually looking for caterers to sample the products, so I will put a link or I'll put an email in the description so that if you are a caterer and looking at this video, you can email them and they will get in contact with you because they would love for you to try out their products and see if it could, you know, work for you in your prepping of the meals that you do for your clientele. So look out for that. But yeah, you're doing this quick and easy. I want to really show you that they say no big set of fuss and thing. So now I'm prepping my ginger, just using a spoon to peel the skin. This for me is the best way to peel ginger. And so I'm just going to chop my ginger. Let's get a little smash with the blade. And just finally mince it. Okay, so I have a couple of cloves of garlic here. Just going to mince them. And I have a scotch bonnet pepper here. This is optional. I'm only using half. But if you don't want the heat, you could leave this out or you could use pimentos instead. And last but not least, I have some saif here that I'm just gonna chop up. And that's the garnish as we finish the dish. All right, so it's been about five minutes and the rice noodles finish. So I'm just gonna take it out of the pot and I'm gonna run some cold water on it to stop it from cooking. All right, so I'll run the cold water on the pipe water on the noodles. So we'll transfer it to our bowl. And now let's get on with our stir fry. So an important thing to remember is that we're not defrosting the vegetables at all. We're going straight from the freezer into the frying pan. And the best method for doing stir fry is that I have found um, with doing my little trial and error experiments with the product is what I'm going to show you now. So the first thing you want to do is get your pan or your wok real hot and we're going in with the body straight into the pan. Now I'm adding my carrots. Just kind of breaking it up with my hand. So at this point, you might be asking why I'm putting no oil in the pan yet. And that's because I want the water to kind of steam off and that will help cook the vegetables. So there's a kind of steam action happening here. And once it kind of dries down a little bit, then I'll add the oil to start the stir fry process. And as I said, in my little experiment with the product before I did this video, I find that doing it this way gave me the best results. Okay, so once the veggie starts to dry down, now you wanna add your oil. So I'm going in with some vegetable oil. And now I'm adding my onions. And now I'm adding my scotch bonnet pepper, ginger and garlic. Adding half a teaspoon of MSG, tablespoon of soy sauce. Now I add in my rice noodles. And all this wanna garnish with some fresh side and some sesame seeds. I'm 
gonna serve a little bit here. All right, time for a little taste. Yeah, so let me tell you, for something that takes like 15 minutes to cook, this real lashing, real flavor from the ginger and the garlic, nice little heat from the scotch bonnet pepper, and most importantly, our veggies still have a nice little bite to them, which is paramount when using frozen vegetables. So if you're pressed for time and really looking for something convenient that you could whip up quick and easy meals with, the ice house assorted carrots and the ice house chopped body are recommended. Ratings. This was real easy to put together and it deliver a real nice delicious veggie stir fry. Top points, top marks. Special thanks to Ice House for sponsoring this episode of Mhm. Mm and Ice House products can be found at Massey Stores, GTA Supermarket, Better Deal Supermarket, Blooms Imports, and Super Farms nationwide. Also, check out Ice House on social media. They are on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and TikTok. Check them out at Ice House 1924, and you could also check them out on the website at icehouse1924.com and remember to the caterers out there who might be watching this if you want a free sample to try out this product and make it part of your meal preparation you can email them at icehouse1924 at gmail.com i will provide links to all of this in the description box below so look out for that and as always thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one